Today I want to talk about annual ryegrass. Annual ryegrass is not cereal rye or winter rye. It's actually a different plant. Annual ryegrass is a, a cool season grass, but we do need to plant it earlier in the year in Michigan. August is, a, is an opportune time to plant it. We like annual ryegrass because it has a fibrous deep root structure that holds soil and it prevents erosion in the spring and in the fall if we have heavy fall rains. The issue we have with annual ryegrass, however, is because of the deep fibrous roots, it can cause um, issues when it comes to termination in the spring. It can be hard to terminate if it is not terminated at the proper time. So please look at your label when you're terminating it using herbicides to make sure that you are terminating it correctly. Not only is annual ryegrass good for controlling erosion, it is also really good for building up soil. Annual ryegrass with its deep roots can go down into the subsurface and it can mine those nutrients. It can bring up the phosphorus and the nitrogen, specifically the nitrogen for subsequent crops. Because of that, we can also have an issue where we have too much nitrogen, so make sure that when you use annual ryegrass as a cover crop, that you do take a soil sample to make sure that your nitrogen is, a, is sufficient or that there isn't too much nitrogen if you're going to use it for a feed. If you do graze annual ryegrass in the spring, grazing it alone is not effective termination. You will still have to use some sort of chemical or mechanical means to make sure that you do terminate it if you want to terminate it in the spring. Annual ryegrass also can be used to help build up your soil health. We do see a lot of organic matter in the accumulation of the roots with the top growth of annual ryegrass. So if you're looking at something that's going to build up soil, at the same time be used to mine nutrients and to hold soil, annual ryegrass is an excellent choice for cover crops.